Hello everyone, STL Puckhead, back with another video. Um, so today I'm going to talk about um, a few recent pickups. Um, I have a Junk Wax Era Hall of Famer card that I got in this week. Um, and I acquired a couple Cardinal Hall of Fame or Cardinals uh, Hall of Famers autographed bats yesterday in a, a pretty exciting adventure um, with Chris from Missouri and our buddy Mauricio, who you've heard Chris talk about on his channel. Um, and it's related to the state fair find uh, that Chris made where he bought all those uh, vintage baseball cards and all those autographed baseballs or autographed basketballs. Um, we went back to this uh, same guy's house yesterday. Um, I believe he said his name is Tyler. Um, great dude. Um, we were actually at his parents' house is where they had all these um, autographed bats stored. Um, but he's a great guy. Um, his uh, parents are, are great people. Um, they had us three, um, you know, a motley looking crew digging through their machine shop yesterday um, for probably six hours going through about uh, 400 autographed baseball bats. So a few, I'll let Chris go into more of the details on his channel if he decides to do a video about it. Um, I just want to show you what I picked up. Um, but we had so much fun, even though we spent, you know, four to six hours sweating in a, in a, in a metal building, crawling around spider webs and all that stuff going through baseball bats. But man, it was awesome to see pretty much every Hall of Famer you can think of. Um, they had an autographed bat there. So I would like to have come home with about 30 of them myself. Um, but I don't quite have the money that Chris does. He'll, he'll get the joke when he sees this video. So uh, I'm going to quit blabbing, turn this thing around. I'll show you what I've, my most recent pickups. All right, so what I'm going to show you first is my most recent eBay pickup, 84 Donruss, Nolan Ryan. So I guess once, uh, well, I recently picked up the 84 Donruss Ozzy Smith, um, but every day when I go on eBay, I always search for a few players, and Nolan Ryan is one of them. And I search for items ending in under an hour, and this just so happened to pop up. Um, it didn't have any bids on it. Um, I think I bid $25, $29, something like that. So I actually got this cheaper um, than I got the Ozzy Smith rookie. Um, and I, I, it's just a great card. I really like Nolan Ryan. So one of these days, I hope to do his player run. So here are the autograph bats um, that I ended up getting a hold of um, from this 800 autograph bat adventure that we went on yesterday. This is Ozzy Smith. This one doesn't have a certificate, um, but I have seen Ozzy Smith's autograph quite a bit and uh, believe that to be authentic. If you have 800 amazing autograph bats that all have uh, certificates of authenticity, why would you have a fake Ozzy Smith autograph? So, um, again, I believe that to be real. So just cool. These are my first uh, autograph bats. I don't have a whole lot of autographs anyway, cards or balls or anything else, but uh, I have a few. Um, so this may spark the bug f uh, to start getting a hold of more autographs, but bats are just hard to store. So Red Shane Deanst, I've always thought he had a, a great autograph. This one does have a uh, certificate. Um, from, I believe it's uh, GAI. Um, probably not a game model bat, um, but Cardinal Great, Hall of Fame second baseman, Red Shane Deanst. So we had a whole lot of fun uh, picking through these bats yesterday. Um, if you can think of a Hall of Famer or just an amazing um, non-Hall of Famer, he probably has it there autographed. So we had a whole lot of fun digging through stuff um, and digging out these bats. But I'm sure Chris will go into it in more detail on his channel. Um, 
I talked to him last night on the phone. Uh, I, I just, it's awesome that he called me up to go down there with him and go through these bats. Like he asked me if, you know, I was done and, and ready to go back. And I was like, this is, this is my idea of a good time. Like I could have sat out there all day. And at one point I told him, you know, that I would strip, I was willing to strip down in my underwear and juggle these bats just because it was so much fun going through them. But I didn't, I didn't even care. So, um, had a great time. Thanks again for Chris or to Chris for, uh, taking me down there. And, uh, that's it for today. Um, we have uh, an SGC order um, that is down in Florida waiting for SG, SGC to pick it up. I'm assuming today is Sunday. I'm assuming that'll get graded um, and hopefully back to us one day this week. I've already filmed the first part of the video where I talk about what I think the grades are going to be. Um, but once those, once those come back, I'll get the second uh, part of the video sent out with those. So if you haven't already, uh, please... Uh, subscribe to the channel throw this video a like right now I'm at 111 subscribers so I appreciate everybody's uh, support and watching the videos and stopping by and, and checking out the channel so um, please continue to do so um, it's I love sharing my collecting adventures with you guys so I hope you enjoy it too and until uh, the next one I hope you all have a good one and I'll talk to you later